Hello and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl JVB. How are you guys doing today? First and foremost, as always, thank you so much for being here on my channel, checking out my reactions as well as my own music, I hope. And speaking of my own music, I've been pushing these for this week because it's almost holiday season and I have two albums left and those are like super rare. Um, this is Otto's Daughter. This is my solo album, my first one, that I released a while back. This is also kind of old, but they are still there. So I have like about, I don't know, a handful left. I don't know, maybe maybe two handfuls. I don't know. But I wanted to let you guys know. So if you are interested, I can mail these out to you. And when they're gone, they're gone forever. They will never be reproduced. Um, if you haven't yet, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, like button, notification bell. And in case you don't know who I am yet, I'm a singer, songwriter, music producer, and composer, vocal performance coach. And I love doing reaction videos for you guys. So we have Nightwish today, but with Tarja. Yes, did I say that right? Um, it's the Phantom of the Opera, and I have never done that. I've done a lot of songs, most of the songs, pretty much all of them, with Floor Janssen, obviously. I love Floor so much, but it this one deserves to be, um, yeah, to be reacted to by me as well. So, with no further ado, and I think it's actually funny, my first Nightwish reaction was with Tarja, <laughs> which I didn't really know. So, I've learned a lot since then, but I'm really looking forward to this. So, with no further ado, let's just jump straight into it. Nightwish, The Phantom of the Opera. You guys know I love, love, love Nightwish and I had so much fun doing the Hellfest um, performance and I know you guys have recommended more live performances and I will get to them and check them out as well. And I think what might be really interesting and cool to do is like to do maybe like a longer set um, during a live stream, um, either on Patreon or just you know, while we're doing like a YouTube stream. So we'll figure that one out, but in the comments below, let me know what you think with no further ado. <sighs> Tasha, Phantom of the Opera. Guys, I have chills right now. Oh my god, there's something about her voice that is very chilling. It's like, oh. Also, I really, really love her outfit. Ugh, this is so fitting. I want to start from the beginning. I want to hear it one more time. This, she has a really operatic, powerful voice. Wow, beautiful. One more time. Very expressive.
okay, this is freaking epic, awesome. Wow, I love Marco so much and I'm so sad he's not in the band anymore. I love this whole version. I love the the lineup right now, like, oh my God, powerful, so powerful, so much energy. Like when the guitars, when everything like started to like metal, <laughs> it was so cool because I mean, I shouldn't, I didn't know what to expect, but that was just like insane. I want to go back to here one more time. That was just like epic. dramatic. I've never heard Marco sing like that. Holy moly. This is so intense. I have chills right now. Oh my God, this is so freaking intense. It's so dramatic, so theatrical. Her voice is just like powerful and angel, angel-like, but like so, so powerful. And Marco, <laughs> the intensity is just like crazy. I wanna go back to here, love it. It's so good, oh my God. Back to here.
Moly. That was insane. That was absolutely, completely insane. Um, what I really liked is the energy on stage. There was like a different dynamic. Um, never seen that. And I actually have not heard that song on the album version, but I have read in the comments that people said that it's not even a comparison, which I totally understand because sometimes when you play live, it's just, Oh, so much more intense, so much more powerful because it's like a different energy on stage. You know, that, that energy is not always easy to produce in the studio. There's something magical about a live performance and that seems like one of those magical performances. I'm absolutely blown away. And don't get me wrong, I know like there's always this little like, you know, conflict between Tarja and, and, and Floor. To me, there's no, there is really no uh, competition because that was back then and this is now. And I'm so happy, by the way, that Floor is completely cancer free. So that's amazing. Congratulations, Floor. But um, this is mind blowing. I'm absolutely blown away. I think this is like, oh, wow. This is one of those performances that just like deserves definitely a like, yes. But uh, one of those performances that are just like magical and they, it's going to go down in history. And of course, we all love Marco, right? We all love Marco and I miss Marco because especially there, I've never heard him like scream like that and be that intense. I've heard him be intense, but like, I don't know, they had like really good chemistry on stage, um, at least at that performance. So, wow, I'm completely blown away and I'm glad I finally got to check it out. I still have so many more Nightwish songs to check out. And um, the problem was like with Annette, um, the one song I did got blocked. So I kind of shied away from like doing more from her with her. Um, I'm more than happy to do more with Tarja as well. And of course, wherever Nightwish is right now, what they're doing right now, and as well as Floyd Janssen's uh, solo music. I love her so much and I support her always. Um, comments below let me know what you thought of this performance even if you're not necessarily a Tarja fan anymore but I feel like it deserves to be seen and heard and obviously wait this video has like 33 million views yeah so <coughs> I got something in my throat but with that said I'm gonna let you go this is was freaking mind-blowing really amazing I have to watch it a couple more times to really like like take it in more because I feel like the the whole stage setup, everything was just like, oh my God, very magical, very amazing. As always, I appreciate you guys so much for being here watching with me, my reactions, and of course, listening to my own music, like those two albums, if you want them, they're available. All the info is in the description below. I love and appreciate you so much. Also, I have some new merch coming out for the holidays for you. So there will be some calendars, there will be some notebooks, there will be some cool shirts with some cool sayings that we all love so much. Um, and I wanna leave you with something positive, make every day a great day. And you know, be a lover, don't be a hater. You know, like everybody has drama at one point or another. And like, I know Nightwish had like a lot of drama going on and people kind of like got divided by like, I love this version, I love that version. Just think of it as like a band evolves and people evolve. Sometimes people break up and then they people take sides, you know. It's like, it's normal. It's, 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 it's growth. It's change is something that is con the most consistent thing is change. So adapt to change, appreciate the past and, you know, definitely live in the now and look forward to the future, whatever that may bring. We don't even know, but don't hold grudges and don't, it's just not worth hating on someone or something that is first of all already in the past, but also it, it was just part of who this band has become because of the members that were there. And so there are certain things we can change. And I always think, especially with bands like Nightwish, you know, they've lost a few members, like not now that Marco's gone and they could have easily said, well, you know what, we are done, but they haven't. And aren't you glad they're still around, even though Marco's not in the band anymore, but it's still nice that they are still doing it. They found a new member and that they're going 
and doing their thing anyway because that's what we want we want to see them thrive we want to see them do what they love for as long as they want to and are able to so i appreciate that so much keep that in mind before you just like go off on a rant like ah, hate that member like hate that member don't like that member <laughs> the old version is better than the new version whatever it's at the end of the day just appreciate it because you always have the albums to go back to and or to not go back to so with that said, I'm going to let you go. If you haven't yet, make sure that you hit that subscribe button, like button, notification bell so you never miss a post of mine. And I will see you in the next one. Take care. Much love.